Hello my fellow car modelers, how you doing today? This is a vlog from Luca's Vacation. I've been working a little bit on my car. I've been kind of sidetracked and I kind of can't stay away from you guys. I want to show you what I'm working on with that Volvo. I've been kind of kicking around on it a bit. Got some things painted and let me show you what wheels and tires I decided to go with. A little quick update of what I've been doing to this really neat model car kit. I'm having a good time with this one and I'll kind of tell you what my plans are. All right, so just a quick rundown. Uh, got the chassis all painted, nice and white. I'm just going with all white. Got the roll cage going. And as you can see, the car set at ride height with some wheels. This is what I ended up going with. The wheels right out of the kit. And I found some treaded tires, some Pegasus tires. They're probably a, compared to the kit tires that are, of course, slicks, racing slicks. I wanted to go with treaded tires because I'm making this a street legal car. I wanted to have a little bit uh, thicker sidewall, and I got that in these tires and a nice aggressive tread pattern. So, going with the wheels that came out of the kit, I got them painted black, painted a TS29 to me, a semi gloss black, and then, of course, with some metalizers, I painted up the hub so you can get some good detail there. Nice looking tire and wheel combination. I think I'm going to get the look I want. Again, I'm making a street car out of this, but it's going to be like a race car. Like someone took a street car and put a full cage in it and kind of raced it all out, but they keep it on the street and, you know, do some canyon carving, make some track days and stuff like that. But it's going to be a civilian car with a license plate. And something I always do, I always like to kind of make up a story in my head when I'm building a model as if it was a real car. With what I would be doing if this was my car, if I had one of these Volvos and was racing it out, I would kind of want to pay homage to the 1994 winner of the British Touring Car Circuit, which was this Volvo. That's what they made this kit for. So I've decided that I'm going to kind of paint it the same. I'm not going to use the decals, but I'm going to paint it up the same as the car. I got a couple of really cool ideas that I'm probably going to show you guys of what I'm going to do when it comes to painting. I got some neat paint tricks I'm going to show you. And I'm going to do the blue and the white, but just kind of a little bit of a different angle. Like I said, it's going to be something that if I was to do this car in real life, it would be paying homage to that race car. But I don't want to have all the stickers all over it, so I just wanted to have that blue and white paint scheme. But I think I'm going to go with a little bit more of a metallic or candy metallic. And I'm going to show you how I do that a little later in another video. A oh, quick update. Letting you know how my vacation is going, working on the model, working on my Mustang. Temperatures are starting to go up, but still real nice here in Phoenix. It's perfect working on the car weather, painting out in the garage, painting the parts. So uh, I'm going to get back on this, and I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks a lot. And I almost forgot one of the biggest reasons why I wanted to get on here and send you guys out a vlog today is because today I hit 500 subscribers, and that is really awesome. This is really taking off. I really appreciate it. And uh, I want to keep on trucking and keep on bringing you guys better content. So keep on supporting me. I'm working on getting better at doing these. I hope this is working out for you and you're liking it and you like like it. It's got good entertainment value. You're learning something about model cars. And don't forget, Saturday morning, 9 o'clock Pacific time, I'm going to be with Andy at a, on Hobby Talk Live over on Andy's Hobby Headquarters. There's a link at the end of this video for you to go over there and check out his channel and subscribe to him if you haven't already. And I bet you a lot of you have because I'm getting a lot of you guys from Andy. So... You know, I've been riding his coattails for a while. i got to give him a big, big thank you because he has been my huge supporter. And I think that's what's been getting my channel to take off pretty quick. I know it is. I know that's where it's going because I'm getting a really good push from him. He's been a lot of help and a lot of support and working with me, being in my videos. I'm being in some of his. And, and we're just, we're, him and I got a lot of big plans in the future to do a bunch of stuff together. We're having a good time with this. And talking about the hobby is just something we love to do him and i do it all the time so we thought we'd bring it to you so check us out on saturday mornings at nine o'clock pacific time my camera quit so i'm doing this on my phone really quick so the quality might have changed a little and my lighting isn't that great but again i just wanted to say thank you guys so i'm going i'm going to get back on working on my model and being in my vacation okay so if you don't mind i'm i'm gonna go back to relaxing because this has been pretty neat and i'm getting pretty relaxed this Volvo, it's coming around good, and I'll be back with you guys on, on the Volvo. By the end of the vacation, we're going to show you how far I get. I'll see you in the next video.
Well, if I... Oh, God.